guys what's up and welcome back to my channel if you are new welcome I'm so excited to have you if you're following my previous video thank you so much for coming back I've loved having you on my orange Day fitness journey um, today is a little bit different than normal um, it is a Saturday it is um, the Saturday before Easter so um, I think this video will go up the Monday after Easter so I hope that if you celebrate Easter that you had a fantastic one with your loved ones um, and spent some time with them. So like I said today is Saturday and I am getting ready to leave for my Orange Theory class. It is just now getting bright outside. Um, the sun is just coming up. For those of you that have followed my journey for um, a couple weeks, you know that my Saturday routine is normally a 9.30 class at Orange Theory, um, but unfortunately some schedules got changed for the week, um, and so Chelsea is coaching at 8.15, and I am a loyal Chelsea goer. So I changed my class to 8.15, so I am going to go to my Orange Theory class. I will let you know how it was afterwards. I am also going to be filming my 12-week update today. Thursday was my 12 week update um so my three month um mark at orange theory but unfortunately i was sick um you may be able to still tell in my voice that um, i'm still a little stuffed up um I had a super bad sinus infection and um, double ear infections and it was just um, not a day to go and work out so I waited until the last minute because I guess I thought for some reason that I was gonna make it um, and actually paid the $12 to cancel cuz um, three hours before I realized that it just wasn't gonna happen for me so um, I didn't get a chance to talk to you guys on my three month mark but I'm going to sit down and chat with you guys about that this afternoon so I'm super super excited about that so um I also just want to let you guys know that I know sometimes it seems like I have it all put together and that I am super excited to go to every orange theory class but I'm not gonna lie that I'm struggling this morning um like I said I've been sick and it has been a long week um and it was a long night yesterday um our sweet friends uh, my sweet friend Chelsea who you have met um and my fiance's best friend and her boyfriend Vance um they moved into an apartment yesterday together so um, he helped them all evening while I went to Good Friday service and um, we went um, to dinner with them last night and kind of did some stuff last night at their apartment so um, by the time that we got home and I probably fell asleep it was probably one um, and I got up again at six so I'm kind of struggle busted this morning but I'm still gonna go still gonna make it and I'm gonna kill the workout so I will let you guys know how that goes afterwards and uh, yeah We'll go to the next clip. One more thing before I go. Don't forget if you are not following me on my socials. I will put them right here across the screen somewhere. Make sure that you hop over and do that. Um, not only do um, I do polls and stuff on my Instagram. Um, I always let you guys know when a video goes live. And um, if you follow me on Twitter. I have started a new kind of series. I'm doing an Orange Theory tip of the day. Every day during the week. Um, and they've been super popular. People have really enjoyed them. So make sure that you hop over and do that. And I will see you guys in a minute. I actually just got home. Um, I didn't even think about it when I left to um, film. So um, today was a strength day. It was killer. Um, we had some progressive pushes on the treadmill and a progressive push on the rower, um, which is essentially means like you're going up one incline each time on the treadmill and you're going up a little bit on your pace on the rower. Um, the floor was great. Um, I was able to lift heavier weights today, which was super exciting. So I'm going to sit down later this afternoon and do my 12 week update. This might actually turn into two different videos um my 12 week update as well as this might just end up being like a day in my life vlog because I'm gonna look at wedding dresses today um I've looked at three different places and I just haven't had any luck but this was prior to me working out at Orange Theory so um I think that I might have some luck today so last minute I am gonna go look at wedding dresses here in about an hour and a half so I'm going to run in, I'm going to shower, I'm going to get ready, get all pretty, um, and then we're going to go look at wedding dresses. So I may vlog a little bit of that. That'll be super fun. So um, I may do that. And then a separate video may be my 12-week update. So regardless, you guys are going to get to see my 12-week update, but I'm also going to give you guys a little bit of just like my life and um, wedding planning. I am going to start adding a little bit of wedding planning to my channel because um, Tristan and I just reached our 365 day mark till we get married so our one year mark was um last thursday 
so um next april april 18th we are getting married after um 11 years it will have been 12 years next year so um i'm super excited because we have a lot of things already planned um but some of the like nit nitty gritty as far as like the centerpieces the flowers all that and that'll be super fun to vlog i mean signing papers for a venue isn't super fun so um i'm gonna vlog a little bit of that but today you guys are maybe gonna get to see me shop for wedding dresses so um i'm gonna run in i'm gonna shower i'm gonna get ready and i will see you guys in a bit okay we are at david's bridal we are gonna go in and look at some wedding dresses um i'm with my mom and um, um, we're meeting my sister here who you guys have met but um i don't know if i ever talked about that she is also um my maid of honor and um my mother-in-law is also meeting us here so um i will film some of the dresses inside um obviously not me in the dresses but um i will film some of that and then um i'll probably give the camera to my sister because she'll be able to do it more than i will so um but we are waiting on them and then we're gonna go inside we're looking at dresses. Oh, I didn't realize you were recording. Yeah, oh, you see the recording? We're looking at some dresses, okay? I've picked a couple out that we're gonna try on. Just a few. My mom and my mom and my mother-in-law are chit-chatting. But but we but we are I'm waiting some dresses. dresses. We're gonna try on some dresses. I got I say we, it's you. <laughs> some mermaid ones, some ball gowns. Well, I'm searching out. We probably aren't gonna show you them in it. I mean, but you know, gotta keep it a surprise. Tristan doesn't like mermaid dresses. He told me he didn't like them, but we're gonna try them anyway. It's about you. So, so I might like it. I don't know. Orange theory been losing like three inches. I don't know. I don't know. Doing, like I'm doing my 12 week update next week. I don't know why my phone's ringing when my watch is here, but it's okay. Okay, she's gonna wait. Is this your dress? Are you saying yes? Is this is a dress! Woo! Woo! All right. Very cool. All right. We have left the cake. We have left the cake. Okay, guys. So we just got done at David's bridal, and did we? We found the dress. Um, I tried on a dress the first time that I went to David's Bridal and I loved it but I didn't bite the bullet on it and I tried it on again and I loved it but I wasn't sure so I tried on another dress no two two other, two other dresses um, I put it on for a third time and I bought the dress well my mom bought the dress but mom we bought the it. dress <laughs> all that matters is that we bought the dress so I'm gonna try to put in me ringing like the little bell but i may have to like find a way to edit the little like a square over my body so you can't see the dress because no Haley, Haley did a great job um filming in there but i can't show you guys the dress so yeah so now we're gonna go eat some wings some that's wings. what i'm gonna eat i'm gonna eat some wings because i worked at orange jury this morning and you deserve it and i went a size out of my dress and I have a wedding dress, so we're gonna eat some wings, aren't we? We're gonna have some wings. Okay, bye! <laughs> mm, chicken. 
good morning guys it is Easter um, and it's the next day I wanted to show you guys um, just what I had for breakfast so this is just oatmeal um, I use the Quaker Oats old-fashioned um, oatmeal I do one cup of the oats and I actually cook it in the microwave and then I mix it with a tablespoon of Jif Whips and um, this is just creamy peanut butter um, but it mixes a lot better because it is like whipped um, and then on top I have one cup banana and then I top it <clears throat> excuse me I top it all off with honey bunches of oats granola honey roasted um, I am not a fan of oatmeal but I have been loving this um, so I wanted to share with you guys what I was having for breakfast good morning happy Easter um, I never closed the vlog out yesterday after we um, ate lunch um, because I did some stuff yesterday afternoon and I hung out at um, my fiance's house last night so we I just never got a chance to get back on the lighting is so bad but it's okay we're gonna make it work um, so today is Easter we are on our way to church um, and yeah so on the way home I have to stop at the store so I can get some stuff to make my meals for the week um, we are gonna have lunch at my house um, and then we will have dinner at um, Tristan's family's house tonight so um, I will let you know when I get at the grocery store um, and what I'm going to make this week because as of right now I don't know what I'm gonna make this week but we're gonna go to the store and find out that's always the worst way to go to the store when you don't know what you need but so that's what we're doing um, yeah so I will see you guys after church when I go to the grocery store okay so I'm gonna walk you guys through what I got at the store I got some fresh strawberries and blueberries um, I've talked about this a lot but these are my absolute favorite um, I also got some of my favorite crackers which are the pita crackers with sea salt um, some of the roasted garlic hummus I've never had this one but I'm super excited to try it um, I showed earlier the Jif whips that I eat instead of regular peanut butter um, just some beef jerky um, I got some salsa because that's what I'm gonna meal prep this week um, I also got some fire roasted corn and then I'm gonna show some potatoes and that is also gonna be in my meal prep this week which I will be showing you guys here in a minute um, some roasted red bell peppers and green bell peppers that I'm gonna be preparing um, my favorite snacks these are the balance breaks these have cheddar cashews and dried cranberries um, this Southwest Chipotle ranch is gonna be used in my meal prep prep um, these are for breakfast they are just the light hundred calorie multi-grain English muffins I love to put peanut butter on those um, some chicken breast and my favorite coffee which is the caramel macchiato from Starbucks as well as some bananas for this week of my meal preps I have decided to do a chicken burrito bowl um, I'm just cooking the rice right now in this pan and then I am also cooking the chicken just in a skillet um, right next to the rice so the chicken is cooking right now um, it's just is plain right now I don't know that I show it but I am just gonna be putting some pepper supreme and just regular salt and pepper nothing super fancy um, in these little containers I'm doing spicy ranch that chipotle ranch that I showed earlier as well as sour cream in one of the containers and then the last container is just gonna be that cantina salsa that I showed you guys that I got from the grocery store um, I'll use all of these on top of my bowl so here I am just putting that cooked rice into the container I'm um, just enough really to fill the bottom I don't want to have a ton of rice um, but just about a quarter of the way full so that I can mix everything and still have room in the bowl for all of it then next I'm adding in that chicken all I did was cook it in that pan with that pepper supreme and um, salt and pepper and then I'm just throwing it on the right side of the container um, I'm cutting up some red and green bell peppers that I'm also going to be cooking in a pan um, I just added some plain peeled those diced tomatoes um, they're just plain diced tomatoes in that pan with the um, red and green bell peppers and I'm just adding some pepper supreme and salt and pepper to those as well nothing super fancy um, just to give them some seasoning um, so I'm throwing that in as you can see I've already put all of the containers inside of my um, meal prep container I also did want to uh, talk about the fact that I did do that fire roasted corn I didn't show that but I did do the fire roasted corn underneath um, those containers so that is also in my bowl 
Okay, so I'm going to end the video here. Um, I just had lunch with my family and got all my meal prep ready, which will be in this video. So that is super exciting. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you guys had a fantastic Easter if you celebrate it. Um, I am going to be filming my 12-week update, so that will be coming this week. So keep an eye out for that. So if you like these kind of videos, um, kind of like the weekend style and um, some meal prep, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Never forget to subscribe down below and hit that bell right next to the subscribe button so that you never miss another video and you get notified of all my future uploads. I hope that you guys are having a fantastic morning, afternoon, or evening, whatever time it is that you're watching this. I hope that you're having a fantastic one and I will see you guys very, very soon in my next video. Bye!